Some of us have a habit of cracking up at the most inopportune times. And while no director wants to do hundreds of takes, sometimes a good chuckle gives everyone on set a much needed break from the emotional stress of filming an intense movie. Here are 10 hilarious bloopers from serious movie scenes. X-Men Days of Future Past Hugh Jackman is a professional, but even the most dedicated actors are subject to boredom. And after 16 years of playing the same character, we can't blame him for wanting to shake things up a bit. While working on X-Men Days of Future Past in 2014, Jackman was full of funny faces, and he would flash them at the camera during some of the film's most serious moments. When you're in the zone, distractions can be frustrating, but Hugh Jackman's hilariously contorted face is always a welcome distraction, even if it is an expensive one. Guardians of the Galaxy after breaking out with Parks and Rec and Lego Movie, Chris Pratt was beginning to make a name for himself on the big screen. But that didn't mean he was going to stop having fun. Guardians of the Galaxy is full of lighthearted humor, and Pratt carries the role of Peter Quill like a natural. But some of the funniest moments didn't come from the script. Well, not completely, anyway. In a tense moment with the film's terrifying antagonist Ronan, played by Lee Pace, Quill jokingly challenges the villain to a dance-off. In the final cut, he's denied, but there is one shot on the gag reel where both he and co-star Zoe Saldana take Pratt up on the offer. Kill Bill Volume 1 Quentin Tarantino's movies are messy. Nowadays, you may be able to turn on your TV and choose from a plethora of violent shows. But blood and guts haven't always been so easy to find. The director has a habit of casting renegade female leads, and Uma Thurman is on top of his list. As the bride in the Kill Bill series, she fights her way to the top of a syndicate of assassins. By 2003, Uma Thurman knew what to expect from working with Tarantino, and obviously enjoyed the collaboration. In one take, the actress fights an entire gang. After ripping a prosthetic eyeball out of a member's face, she turns to the camera and delightedly asks if she can do it again. Thor The Dark World Chris Hemsworth has a pretty high standard to live up to as the human embodiment of Thor. As we've seen time and time again, humans are not capable of defending the Earth, so the Asgardian powerhouse has a lot of responsibility. That kind of job requires a reliable weapon, one you can really count on in a fight. And while the final cut of the movie would have you believe Thor's hammer was always ready to rock, the gag reel says otherwise. Right in the middle of a scuffle, Mjolnir's head disconnects from the handle and Hemsworth cracks up. The Avengers now that we've established how crucial a good weapon is when saving the world, it's important that the actors look badass wielding them. It just wouldn't be canon to see Thor drop his hammer in slow motion. It's not right. Marvel released some extra bloopers that are definitely worth watching, especially if you're a fan of Thor. And you can watch as Chris Hemsworth trips over his cape and can't quite get a grip on the spinning hammer. All the while, Chris Evans is stealing the scene, executing his own move flawlessly. Maybe capes really are a hazard. Star Wars Episode IV A New Hope when it comes to Star Wars, Darth Vader probably gets the most attention out of all the villains. But he's not the only snake in the grass. Governor Tarkin is the stone-cold killer who really pulls the strings on the Death Star. Princess Leia pleads with him to kindly not blow up her home planet of Alderaan, and wouldn't you know it, he ignores her. Tarkin is such a dick that it's easy to forget that he's actually just a guy. More than that, he's a guy who messed up his lines a couple of times and broke the scene's palpable tension. The Martian the Martian took audiences on a ride to Mars with Matt Damon. The actor essentially carries the entire film. And because of its narrative structure, the actor is tasked with translating complex scientific jargon into an accessible format. But some fans would argue that potatoes are the real star of the movie. As astronaut Mark Watney, Damon uses all of his wits to sustain himself on the red planet. But for as smart as he is, the outtakes reveal he's not so good at counting. While filming a scene where Watney's making a calendar, there is a take where the actor gets his numbers mixed up, and then immediately apologizes to the props department for screwing up their calendar. Star Trek. If we only had one word to describe the character of Spock, we would choose composed. Resident Vulcan genius on the good ship Enterprise, Commander Spock is a supremely logical and unemotional man. Zachary Quinto, on the other hand, isn't so lucky. Being a human from Earth, the actor is susceptible to the short attention span and high distractibility characteristic of us mere mortals. While shooting the sequence where Spock questions Scotty about beaming onto the ship while traveling at warp speed, the dumbfounded look on Simon Pegg's face consistently made Quinto laugh and required multiple takes. Captain America 
Vibranium is one hell of an invention, and as you can see by looking at Captain America's shield, it's durable as hell. If only it were real. The props and costuming departments went through prototype after prototype when deciding on a model for the big screen, and when it came time for the chosen one to break a lock during a tense moment in The Winter Soldier, it couldn't deliver. The outtakes show Chris Evans flailing his shield at the door and eventually bursting into laughter at the unexpected reaction. In every take, Scarlett Johansson's Black Widow looks on with the giggles. Star Wars Episode 1, The Phantom Menace Okay, so there were a lot of things wrong with The Phantom Menace, but some of the funniest fails are also the simplest. R2-D2 is not exactly a nimble robot, and rolling over uneven terrain proved to be a challenge for the droid. In the film's extras, the blooper reel shows R2 falling over in the background in multiple scenes, which obviously cracks everyone up. But in one sequence, Padme and Anakin are walking along behind a masked extra who full-on walks into the poor droid, nearly knocking him over. Jake Lloyd and Natalie Portman are able to keep their composure for approximately two seconds before exploding with laughter. What do you think of our video? Did we skip over any of your favorite bloopers from serious movie scenes? Let us know in the comments, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great videos like this one. Thanks for watching.